you've received a copy of the handbook, but you're probably thinking, okay, what do I really need to know? Let's start with communication. Social media is a fun way to share your life and opinions with family, friends, and coworkers. We hope you'll follow us on Facebook and Twitter, but when it comes to posting, be sure to use good judgment. Masonic Homes of Kentucky is a business. Do not post about the people we serve. Avoid using statements, photos, video, or audio that may violate HIPAA or the privacy of those under our care. Be sure to only post appropriate and respectful content. Next, mobile phones. We know that in this day and age, everyone always has their phone on them. However, do not use your phone while you are on duty. Save your texts, phone calls, etc. for your breaks. Media. Sometimes you will see Masonic Homes in the news for doing great things. If you receive a request from any media outlet, TV, newspaper, magazine, website, etc., refer to the Corporate Communications Department right away. Do not speak to the media without permission. Have open communication with your supervisor and community leaders. Be sure to ask questions and let us know if you need to get something off your chest. We are here to help. Now let's talk about one of our core values, remarkable service. First, come to work on time. Your regular attendance and punctuality are essential to providing exceptional customer service to those we serve. We know that unexpected situations happen. If you're going to be late or miss work, take accountability and let your supervisor know as far in advance as possible, at least four hours before your scheduled shift time. PTO, or paid time off, is one of the many benefits we offer to our employees. You begin earning PTO on your first day and can begin using it once you've been on the job for six months. Here's a chart that shows how many hours you receive each year. Holidays are included in the PTO you earn, so if you want to take off work on a holiday, you must use the hours you have accrued. Be sure to talk to your manager in advance of your first holiday to find out more about how that works. Today, you will place your first apparel order through the Masonic Homes of Kentucky online store. All new employees receive a credit to their online apparel account. Full-time employees receive $75. Part-time and PRN employees receive $35. All merchandise identified for your department in the online store is appropriate to wear to work. Along with your uniform, you should always wear your photo ID badge while on campus. If your ID badge is stolen, report it immediately to your supervisor. Now that you know what to wear, let's talk about professional appearance. Be sure your clothing is clean and appropriately sized. Any tattoos must be covered at all times. Wearing jewelry and visible pierced body parts is prohibited, except for the ears. For a full list of appearance guidelines, refer to the employee handbook. If you have any questions about whether or not your dress or appearance is appropriate, or need to discuss any accommodations for religious or physical purposes, contact your direct supervisor. Confidentiality. Maintaining confidentiality is a condition of your employment. Working in the healthcare industry, it is critical that we ensure the privacy and protection of resident medical records in accordance with HIPAA. Any information relating to the company, its employees and residents is considered confidential. Conflicts of interest. Do not participate in activities that will hurt your job performance. If you have a financial or employment relationship with a competitor, vendor, or customer, please disclose this to Human Resources so that we can resolve any conflict before it may exist. Accepting gifts or cash from residents or business contacts is also considered a conflict of interest. Please consult your supervisor to determine what is and isn't appropriate. Sexual and other unlawful harassment. We are committed to providing a work environment that is free from all forms of discrimination and conduct that can be considered harassing, coercive, or disruptive, including sexual harassment. Actions, words, jokes, or comments based on an individual's sex, race, color, national origin, age, religion, disability, sexual orientation, or any other legally protected characteristic will not be tolerated. You should immediately report to your supervisor if you experience or witness sexual or unlawful harassment in the workplace. If your direct supervisor is unavailable or if it would be inappropriate to contact your direct supervisor, you should immediately contact Human Resources at your community or any other member of management. You can raise concerns and make reports without fear of reprisal or retaliation. Code of Ethics Each of us is expected to observe basic rules that guide our behavior in the workplace. 
Our expectation is that you will possess good conduct related to common courtesy, attendance, reporting, and maintaining work standards to achieve optimum care and services. Employees who are unwilling to follow these guidelines or who abuse company rules and regulations will be subject to corrective action. For a list of offenses and their penalties, please refer to the Employee Handbook. So there you have it, your five-minute overview of the Employee Handbook. If you ever have questions, your supervisor is here to help.